Oh, I hate when I push the wrong buttons. Wrong buttons, wrong buttons. Wrong buttons galore, boys. So, you know, not sure what's going okay. on. I was going to say, it seemed a bit off there. <laughs> it was a little off. It was a little off. So, yes. So, we've got uh, we've got a fun show today. We've got, uh, eventually, McLeod's going to be on his way. We've got Apple Pear here. And uh, we've got Bargos. And possibly Dirk in a bit. And Dirk, yes, that's right. Dirk is supposed to come in a bit here. So... We got a full show, lots to talk about, um, and we we're just about to talk about something interesting. So before I said, "Oh yeah, I'm going to mute you, Bar Ghost," and uh, go mess up the intro, as I often do. <laughs> so we don't know if Caleb's coming. We don't know who's coming, but we'll figure it out. And nobody was ready to be on camera today except me. So you've got my ugly mug. I sound like a scratchy robot. That's really strange. Because there is a, a Blue Yeti over here. So, is that better, Morinin? Am, am I better somehow? There are people here. Don't uh, worry. Hi. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, so let me get uh, McLeod. McLeod needs a little work to get rolling. So, uh, you know, Bargo Snapple Pair, would you uh, chat for a little bit while I had to... Um, Get him in here. Oh, I, I don't, I don't know what there's to chat about, Apple. Do you? I have no clue. Um, what do you mean, no clue? You guys are terrible. There's totally no hints of a war about to go down, right? War? What is war? Yeah. I have never heard about that. <laughs> did, did you hear about wars? I, I never heard about wars. No, I... Uh, I don't think anything's happening. I me neither. I mean, there's a lot of drama, seemingly. Is it drama? drama? Oh, I I haven't heard about drama. I thought everybody was sitting around the campfire singing, kumb twiddling their thumbs. Oh. Is I'm twiddling. <laughs> twiddling, twiddling. Pravi drama. Yes, yes. That the... that was where I was going to go for a second. Pravi I'm drama. Keep this chain. I never, I never follow Provi, so I don't know if there's drama. Yet. Uh, we, we I might, had I'm a show sure. on TIS. Certain people in Provi got triggered that they got mentioned and called out, which then meant that we ended up doing a second show on it, and they got even more. Who cares about right. that? But, yeah. All right, I've got McLeod all situated, so we'll, yeah, he'll be here in a bit. Uh, he has rejoined. So there He's is. Uh, just in the chat. Yeah. So uh, so drama. I love drama in Eve. Yes, you do. I do. I do. And I heard war, like real war. Is this real war? Or is this fake war? I I don't I know. I have not heard about that. Well, um, if it's real war, I might have to rejoin. <laughs> you're not. You're not playing Eve. No, I've kind of taken a break and moved into a holding court. But if this is a real war, uh, I might need to get involved. I'll rip you. Hmm. Kick him off? What? We don't want Should we kick off? <laughs> Probably me for not being in Imperium right now. Oh, I agree with that. I also agree. Man. Never not kick him off. There we go. 53 months, baby. Who's 53 months? That's me, 53 months sub to the channel. Um, That's a congrats. long time. Yeah. That's way too long. I mean, how many of those year, uh, how many of those months have you been doing this show? Uh, all of them. That is a, or hell a of a show. Long time. <laughs> this show in some form. So when we started streaming on um, McLeod and I, actually it was not, was it McLeod? I'm trying to think. It was McLeod and I, or Space Mexican. We started doing this show um, related to the Imperium and H1Z1. 
and it has mutated over the years <laughs> to be pushed to talk. Okay. It was, uh, it was, um, I forget. McLeod will remember what it was. And I some, think I've heard him say whiskey gaming show or something. That was the was second that iteration. Okay. Or history lesson. History lessons here on Push to Talk. Um, it, uh, it was um, something with zombies in the beginning. Well, we're just going to have to wait for McLeod to... I got to see if I can find that intro, and that would be cool to play, like maybe next week. Um, also, we had, a, we had a fan make a really cool H one Z one intro for us. Also, Mike, uh, Mike in uh, Twitch chat is saying that uh, I don't play Eve either, and I know we don't get to Eve until the second half of the show. But I just want to say, like, I spent last night refitting my Titan, or like buying the refits for my Titan and getting ready to go because. Uh, War time is fun, baby. Sorry, what's war? War? We're, nobody's going yeah, to war, what? Dirk. I don't know what you're talking about. Maybe I'm just going to war then. Like Apple, solo. A Apple YOLO, said... YOLO my Titan around for fun. Apple said nothing was going I... on. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. I don't know anything about war. Well, I mean, yeah. whilst we joke, I'm kind of half there like... Yeah, I, I can see that being an attempt, and it just fizzled. But yeah, like, my Titan's getting refit. I'm, uh, I'm checking out where all my shit is. I'm, I'm kind of, kind of almost on the way back, even though my real life is still busy as fuck. Like, you know. Welcome to a, a certain virus going around, right? But, uh, yeah, still pretty fucking busy. Like, the reason I was late tonight is because I was working late. The uh, the first iteration was called the Undead Zone. Oh, it's a bit of a. And it was uh, me and Spanks and Space Mexican, and then McLeod. Scary as I found all of the promos and everything. <laughs> Jesus, definitely. Uh, the intro wow, was really good. We're, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to show some of that next week. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I just scroll my chat. Uh, Transmega, thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. I saw the follow in there. Uh, also, uh, Cyber Optics HS. Who else do we want to go through? Uh, Sikander Cole, subscribe with Twitch Prime for eight months now. They're on a four month streak. Um, let's see if there's anyone else I missed as I scroll back here. Uh, um, Trollolo555, thank you for following. And I think we also got, oh wow, Troublesome84, Anthony Boyd Graphics, and Teddy Fear. Uh, and you know what, there we Dirk. go. Uh, and I'll, Dirk! I'll, I'll celebrate my 11 months. There you go. Yeah, I had I had 53 earlier, so. Uh, Dirk, it turns you just out. caused a hype train. So that's a lot of people for the beginning oh, of the show. Oh, I can't yeah. believe that. Hype, hype train. We should we should take a week off every everything. And Moradin, who is a great guy, by the way. Moradin is a great guy. I uh, had dinner yeah. with him uh, a couple months ago. Uh, just, a, just a great guy. Kind of fun fact on the uh, Twitch subs. Uh, your Twitch Prime, like as much as your Twitch Prime goes to the, the creators or whoever that you're subbed with, it doesn't actually count for your... Um, subscription streak huh so like no. I, i've been twitch prime subbed to inn for a while and then i switched my twitch prime sub to mind one because uh -huh. mind one is an awesome guy and if you haven't watched some of his dj streams you are absolutely missing out and so yeah i, I threw some money at inn and uh like yeah <laughs> it, it's kind of a weird thing yeah uh, I, I did the same when Oh god, who was it? Oh, originally when I had mine with a different channel for over a year and a half, and I've actually only got a four month streak there in reality. The, apparently some people are only here for Apple. Oh, are they for me? Oh, I don't know why they would be here from somebody said they're only here for Apple. Because you're a great guy. See yeah. at the moment. I will be World. back uh, back Okay. Five minutes. I'm a bit busy. 
Alrighty. A- Apple there talking himself down. Doesn't know why they'd be here for him. Honestly, Apple. Yeah. And Arendus just joined us. Of mom, baseball, and apple pear. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So, so, so Dirk is refitting his Titan. Yeah, and like seeing what assets I've got around the place. I'm actually like kind of, you know, for a while now, I've been kind of checking in on things, and obviously, I'm still part of cd so i'm doing some stuff in the background but this is the first time that i've seriously been logged in and doing stuff and getting ready to to like you know do shit do things for a little while it kind of feels weird so what are we allowed to talk about and what aren't we allowed to talk about here uh this is something we're not allowed to talk about I was gonna say, like, I always, I always keep, you know, opsec, opsec, man. I mean, to be fair, mm-hmm. as much as we can't talk about the pings, I'm sure a lot of people, like, <laughs> outside of the Imperium, have seen the pings. So, I'm probably the only person that hasn't. Let's be real. Well, yeah, but what you're ping? not, you're not a very good spy. I don't something try about, to spy. Was, uh, there was the something thing. about Reddit about it. Yeah, there's been a few Reddit things. Oh, oh, is there a Reddit thing? Should we talk about a Reddit thing? No. No. Reddit yeah, things are it. not allowed on this show. <laughs> that, that, that was a very facetious question. Uh, but there is a nice YouTube video going around from someone in the Imperium. I don't know who it is. Is, is this... I mean, I know who it is, but I don't know who they are. If that which, which, which video is it? Yeah. The one that is your move, New Eden. Ah, Idana, uh, yeah, okay. Idana, I, Idana Falwell, who is a a Karma Fleet guy, absolutely fantastic guy, love him to bits. Uh, went drinking with him. Um, actually, Bar Ghost, you were at um, Eve London last year. Yes, I'm sure you probably met him at some point. Probably did. Might just not um, recognize the name. He's from somewhere in kind of Central Europe. I want to say Germany or one of the close countries to Germany. Anyway, Idana is an absolutely great dude. He's been making some videos for a while. Like, this is not his only video that he's done for things. And uh, just generally, his videos are funny and kind of fun. Can we can we link it? Uh, we can definitely link it. And yeah, I have uh, definitely yeah. not seen it. Um, so there it is linked in Twitch chat. Um, I'll drop it in staff for you, Eric, and we could probably just, like, throw it up and watch it real quick. Yeah, I'll, I'll work on that in the background while you guys chit-chat. Because, yeah, like... We should have a McLeod sighting soon, too. Um, a, a McLeod sighting? Is he yes. back in the server? He is. Uh, hey. Um, he said he would drop by. And we got an horrendous, too, and we got an apple pear for those who are so- on late. <laughs> So, so this is going to be feisty well, then. No. Should I just should I just stay shut up when McLeod gets? No, come on. <laughs> okay, I'm glad I'm not the one that had to mention. Anything I don't think it's, on I think I think I think uh, we're good now. Um, no, let me. Uh... Why would you have to be the one to mention it? I didn't know what was public knowledge on what? stream so about, I was there. Uh, about the fact that they had not about what happened publicly stream. <laughs> yeah yeah i'm on about the fact that mcleod left uh, the, well you know just... we talked about it last was it last week was it the week, week before? before week okay. before whenever and you know i, I publicly apologized you know, acknowledged that i was you know a, a little overboard there and you know something of a dick you know it, it's that's fair it's not like it's not like you're going to find any of my friends who will say I'm not a dick. <laughs> but this is very true. He's a known dick. No, I just I was as I said uh, I wasn't I'm sitting sure. Here, I'm, was hold on, I'm on I'm on uh, bagofdicks.com. What's your address, Arendis? I don't <laughs> I don't need a bag of dicks. <laughs> yeah, they're actually. <laughs> I'm like, is it? <laughs> I, I know what they are. I know they're basically just gummies, but you know, I, I'm trying to lose weight, Eric. 
I don't yeah, need a too. bag of candy. Me too, after this also, COVID week. Also game. diabetic, so really don't need a bag of candy. Yeah, that would be bad. But you know what? I can see if there's they got a sugar-free version, maybe. No, sugar-free sucks. I know, doesn't it? I think you like, get that sugar-free chocolate, and you're like, ugh. So, all right. Silence on the stream. That's not going to work. Why work this up, guys? Come on. Well, so I'm just, I'm just kind of stunned about the fact that, like, it's only I now. I just said I was a bit busy, so I, I will explain in a second what happened. Okay. Oh, I, I something was, happened I was to be explained. Being, Wonderful. I, I was just being quiet because I was a little shocked that it's only like 20 after, and you've already been talking about Eve. Well, I know it's... to be fair, like Mike baited me with the the <laughs> fact that I'm not playing Eve, and I, I'm, I'm I'm not ashamed to say that I took the bait because you know. Are, are you a master are, of Eve? People have been yelling at me recently about, you know, why I'm not playing Eve and, you know, where have I been and things. So, yeah, it, 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 it's been kind of weird, actually, to have people go, where, where did you go? What are you doing? So, yeah, there we go. So you're basically doing the same as I've done, but I just hopped into a outfit because... Uh, I, I would never leave. I thought I'd be away. Uh, I linked in staff what happened. Ah! Oh, ah. God's <laughs> sakes! That's hilarious. Um, can we can we link this to stream chat, Apple, and you can? Oh yeah, no problem. Time? All right, so uh, this is what Apple's been busy with, guys, in Twitch chat. Of course, it's Evan McLean again. <laughs> Sorry, just laughing. Like, <laughs> uh, this is why you don't go to F7C at the minute. T2 rigged Chimera, Jesus. With T1 fighter supports. Oh, dear lord. Evan, yeah, man, I, I, was a, I, was a bit, I was a bit busy warping around system to saves, etc. to uh, until my DT timer was over. So uh, that's, that's why I was a bit busy. So, but yeah, so that, that's what I did. Sorry about talking about Eve early, but uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no problem with that. To no be way. honest, I... Sorry, you uh... No, go ahead. I was just going to say, I think given the events of this week, should we make an exception to the normal rule? Sure. I, I think we've blown past exception at this point. Yeah, probably. Sure. I mean, just change it in post, though, just just so it doesn't <laughs> seem bad. I'm pretty sure we just upload the straight VODs, which is why we keep getting demonetized. So, you know, whatever. Oh, I thought it was a game to get demonetized. Did you manage to get demonetized before I got here? Uh, not yet. I mean, but you. We came, mentioned so. we mentioned coronavirus. So if Twitch is playing by YouTube rules, yes, we've been demonetized. There we go. Now, can well, yeah, I... but you, like you didn't swear in the first few minutes or anything. No, Nothing. No, no, no. Uh well. All right, we've got to try harder to get demonetized over the next Man, forty fuck minutes. Demonetization, coronavirus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a hell of a time getting this stupid video into a into a frame, so keep going, boys. Jesus, Eric, why are you so bad with the technical stuff? I don't know. I just I just, you know, went to Orval to shoot at a Titan. Okay. Did you actually get your SP? Because I hear it's no. not working. No, it's bugged, it's a known issue. They'll the logs will show something. The logs will show something. That's a yeah. from CCB. Is there any I sound mean, with this video? Uh, should be. I believe so. Yes. Hmm. Like I should be doing terrible sound things. Let me get the chat up because I haven't even had a chat up until now because I was doing other things. Hmm. Okay, hmm. so somebody's mentioned in Twitch chat. I mean, I haven't seen the video yet. I just know why Dana does some great videos, but oh, apparently it's, somebody... It's, it's, it's a... Some, somebody watched it and they can't stop super villain laughing. So this could be Yes. Fun. I mean, given the title, yeah, I've got a feeling well, the title and the splash of the loading, right. It it feels like, yeah, there might be a good few laughs on. I mean, I I think Is it Apple or Arendis or both that have a day gone? I have uh, I have the one Apple used to have. I don't yeah, know if you got right. Me. Okay. Yeah, the, the 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 one that I had and Arendus has now is the first day gone in the game. 
Yeah, because I'm I'm looking at the the splash screen, the thumbnail for it, and I'm thinking that that is very much a Dagon. No, up in front. No, that's the. Uh, oh, is that's that the apostle skin? with the with the Australian wildfires. Oh right, okay. I mean, to be fair, that does look like quite a cool skin. Oh, it is. It's just a Dagon in disguise. <laughs> No, that's got a, that's got a, a, a triage module. Do, do they have any skins for the Dagon? One. One. Wow, that's disappointing. Honestly, given what the it's, Dagon is, I. Sorry, you go. It's the old planet discover uh, project discovery one, the the glacial drift. Oh, oh so, god! Of oh. course it is. It's so, a universal skin. Which is actually what I have on mine at the moment. So it's not even a great skin, to be fair. No. Oh, that's a shame. Like the expensive the new skins like though that. look really good. We have a wild person up here. I'm not here. A wild McLeod. <gasps> Sup, dude. Hey, Arendus. All right. And look at that! We didn't kill one another. Yay! Yeah. Uh, uh, we got some salt, by the way, from McLean. So I'm uh, going to just link that in uh, in in chat. And and if you want to read it, it is up there. He he PM'd me that in game. Gone for me. Uh, I, oh, did, yeah, I, I did. I I did like... wonder about. I did <laughs> wonder about putting together a soundboard with like some some soundboard thing of like a Japanese anime, two people going at each other sort of thing. <laughs> like as soon as I came in, but I thought, ah, fuck it, can't be asked. <laughs> I love but, the end. You're welcome. <laughs> I mean, I I don't even get that as so. I'm just there, like I've heard that so many damn times. It doesn't affect. All right. But do, yeah. we, do we so do we want to see if thing. this video plays? If it works, if I don't get sound on it, I'm just going to give up. I don't know if I'm not hearing the sound because I'm doing a preview editor, or what. I don't know, but yeah, we'll find out. We'll find out, and then if it is, we'll just stop playing it. All right, we good with that? Yeah. You can answer. exciting that gets me jazzed up mm -hmm. i i get i get the maniacal laugh yeah that that's <laughs> i like that <laughs> i doubt it is good work but that was pretty great i i mean it's not even wrong now i'm not saying this from any policy perspective because i'm not involved in that but even line membership was pretty well aware that one day something was going to change i mean it, it was as as the video says. It was always inevitable. Like something had to give somewhere. Someone's got to like give, or we're just gonna see things kind of decline and decline. So yeah, once we kind of got into Fozzy Sov and you know things that. The, the whole scenario of the game, once we got to Fozzy Sov, was that you had to condense down, and that condensing down means that eventually you're either going to have to go somewhere and do something crazy, or you're just going to run out of content. So, yeah. Someone's got to give, and 
I don't know. I hope something something gives soon. I just think, I just think that this is this is a great move right now with with everything going on. This is exactly the tone we want to take. I mean, let's face it. Everybody coming together for one big freaking gigantic threat. Fuck you, Eden. Come. Fuck you, Four Empires. Fuck you, Triggs. Come at us. Wait, wait, is that? Oh, what, that wait, hold on. About? Are we are we talking about the Triggs now? I thought we were I mean, allied to right. the Triggs horrendous. They're yeah, supposed we, to burn high sec for us. We, we, we like the Triggs because they're going to let us jump titans into no, they're, Isaac they're at some they're point not. right they're not, they're like, not. That, that, that's no. coming right don't no. don't don't crush me like this <laughs> i'm going to crush you like that i'm going to say that it is not <laughs> to use the word again it's not inevitable there is a plausible scenario in which when they hard code it in that we can jump there no it's but not gonna don't, happen don't get it's i was about to say don't get I, horrendous. I was about to say don't get your hopes up for if it happens, it happens, but realistically, it's not going to happen. Yeah. Ar Aria, to be fair, like, I, 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 Aria says in Twitch chat that if you crush my dreams, I might leave Eve again and disappear. And unfortunately, people will have no such luck. My, my dreams are crushed on the regular, as Arendus can attest to. And I just, like, keep going, all right, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> so, a little Dirt's shout out. dreams come pre crushed these days. <laughs> <laughs> he dreams in 2D. So a little shout out here. Tier 1, 57 months to the Vault 1999, which is longer than mine earlier in there. Yeah. And uh, then we've got... A uh, uh, couple of follows. And Dre String on a follow. And Matthew Hang on. and Deja Antonair or whatever. Hang on, Eric. What? How how is how is that longer than yours? Do you not believe enough in your own show to swear to God and invest money that it will be on the on fucking INN for the next five? What the hell is wrong with you? Eric's been subscribed for fifty four months. We had his sub earlier. 50, was it fifty three? Yes. Oh, and four and a half years. Ooh. And I have been running shows longer than that on on INN. Exactly. He so what are you trying to? Money where and by the way, by the way, just so what are you, you trying know, to tell us, Eric? Are you building in an expiration date here? No. Um, uh, you know our new background and everything, and all our new things that we got here. Yeah, we didn't do that the normal INN way. I just, I just paid cash for those. Just so you know. In fairness, it was made by an INN artist. It so, was, but I paid cash for you it. know. I'm I'm pretty sure he probably like got paid through the normal ways as well. Um, yeah, I don't know what they did, but yeah, I did I did I did get cash because they do good work, and I'm quite happy. It, it was good. feed line fifteen. So, what was feed line? Wow! 15? Look, <laughs> wow! <laughs> that's that's some that's some shade, man. Uh, Look, feed line I, I love yeah. him. He does some good work. I get he feeds, but when it comes to art, you got to give him credit. Yeah, like... I don't worry about it. Feed line does some great work for everyone. Um, and to be fair, I, I will shout him out as like one of, uh, one of the great INN art team, a member of the great INN art team, like Redline does some great work along with all oh, the rest of the team. Is, for, this, this, this was this was red, this was Redlines, just so you know. This is a Redline deal. Our background, and I'm sure Arendus would agree that our art team do oh, some stellar work. Yeah, no, 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 no argument there at all. Although I have to admit, I, I I've seen some art in the last day or so that seriously blew me away just from how cool it looks. And it had nothing to do with our art team. This is very true. That was a fantastic image. Mm -hmm. should, we, do, should we share it? Uh, yeah, I let me drop uh, it. In yeah. Please do, because I haven't seen this. Whatever. This is this is a really cool image. Who did this one? Oh, Dan. That is an in-game screenshot by Jeff. Is that taken for the competition? No. like That was, uh, that was just him screenshotting shit as far as... Hmm. Maybe he should yeah. drop it in on the competition. Probably should. I'll mention it. 
Yeah, for, for those who don't know, CCP are currently running uh, a competition where you find, you know, the best in-game screenshot that you've taken or mm -hmm. will take. You know, you can put it together if you want, but basically you, you submit it via Twitter, I think. I've and... just found my in-game image for uh, for that competition. Yeah, so, so McLeod <laughs> apparently has... Wow. McLeod has info on this competition. He can fill us in better than I can. Go on, McLeod. Nah, I've already I've already put mine in, so that's all. Yeah, good. no, but what's the competition? Uh, so the competition is basically uh, you wanna it's it's the Eva's beautiful competition. Uh, essentially, you uh, CCP wants you to uh, tweet or I think it's I think it's I think tweet um, and include an image uh, that doesn't have any UI uh, of an in-game shot that you t that, that you took at some point that you think is beautiful or showcases that Eve is beautiful. And I think it finishes next, like literally next Monday. So you have to kind of get that in quick. But you have to so, also include the hashtag Eve is beautiful thing. So I've, I've just I've just dropped a, a Twitter link to that in. Uh... All right, yeah. Uh, Bard Ghost has the the actual rules and stuff linked in Twitch chat, and I've just dropped a, a tweet to say, uh, as of earlier on today, this is still like still going. So, yeah, it's it's, it's got like just over twenty four hours left. It's twenty three fifty nine UTC tomorrow. There you go, guys. Yeah. So you've got about uh, thirty hours less than like. 28 hours to figure out a, a really nice screenshot of Eve and get it submitted to that. So, uh, yeah. By the way, I didn't know her game wasn't set to Eve Online until somebody... What, what, what was that to? I don't know. I can't see, actually, the game uh, setting in my... Yakuza view. Kiwami 2. Yakuza Kiwami 2. What the fuck is Yakuza Kiwami 2? I got no idea. Not I Eve. Just, I, just, I just changed it. Eve. Um, Hi, RJ. RJ was jamming last night when he was doing his uh, his DJ thing on Facebook. I'm always jamming every Friday. I was uh, I was I was jamming on I think my f sixth martini or something when I started. Dude, watching I couldn't it. understand what language you were speaking or trying to really? type in there. Martini. <laughs> it was the same thing. So, I was wow. uh, I was grooving with some Disserano and Coke of all things. Ooh, together. <laughs> Yes, actually, it tastes very it's good. Nice. And then, and that then sounds I had like... crown off off screen. I had some crown there for the second round, but I didn't get to the second. I, I'm like, sorry, no. and Coke is probably the only drink that I could ever drink Coke warm or, or essentially not warm, but like room temperature. Because room temperature Coke generally sucks. Yes, it's agreed. it's actually supposed to be at room temperature. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Like uh, like drinking Coke at room temperature sucks. But drinking Disarono and Coke at room temperature is actually fairly nice. Disarono on the rocks is good. Mm -hmm. it's, a li I, it's a little syrupy. You got to kind of let the ice melt a little bit. But yeah. The, see, uh, see, that's why I always take the Coke. <laughs> I will tell you like, that. Uh, flash of Coke always works too. It, there's very few drinks that I will say you should definitely like mix it. You know, I, I'm not a fan of like mixing unless you're mixing for like cocktails or whatever but Di oh, okay. definitely uh, Di and coke is uh, there's out, the, out, in the, out in the crowd Di and dr pepper that's a war crime there you go thank you Chris, for uh doing the permit on the mcleod um i can't I, I, i'm grappling with this Di and a sweet drink together they just seems like too much sweet to me i'm gonna have to chest this out you get the balance it's pretty it, sweet right? back back when i was a young lad and I was hanging with some older guys in IT, and we were traveling all the time. You know, we go and we go to these cigar things. And That's like 60 years ago? Not quite that much. But okay. they said, you know, Di Serrano on the rocks with a good cigar is phenomenal. If you would have seen my, my drink behind the baby yoda on the uh the little dj stand there you would have seen that it's a very large like workout mixer cup there's an ass ton of ice in there that helps with the balance and knocking down the sweetness and the syrupy kind of feeling mm. so the and watering it down a little bit is kind of the key <laughs> yeah. and somebody so, said was it morden de serrano and um dr pepper yeah dr pepper is uh, a bit of a weird one for that 
Yeah, that's like so, let's just throw some Doctor Thunder in there. I will tell you two things, and and it's and it's the walnut version of De Serrano, right? Um, they have out there, but either one of those in coffee, you know, a little cream, a little De Serrano in coffee. I love that. That's phenomenal. Oh, you know, it's want... not gonna. I mean, Irish coffee is quite nice. To be fair, well, mm. actually, no. I'm I'm gonna take that back. I'm told Irish coffee is quite nice. Because oh, I don't like coffee, but well, I I'm very coffee. disappointed in myself that this entire like you know lockdown and isolation thing. I have not bought one bottle of Bailey's and had any like Bailey's or you know whatever in my coffee every morning. There is a uh, there is a strawberries and cream Bailey's out right now. I almost Ooh. bought it the other day. Uh, so I'm don't... just gonna say, McLeod, your tweet is wrong. I know. What's wrong with McLeod's tweet? There it's you like later. a hashtag, not added. Yeah. Yep. Might want to fix that. Yeah, I'll fix that. You um, can't. It's, that's how tweets that's a, that is a That is a cool picture, McLeod. Oh, cheers, buddy. There, there was also a, uh, around about Valentine's Day, there was a, a velvet cake Bailey's out. Hmm. Like, Red Velvet Baileys. And I've got to say, every time I saw it, I just kind of like had to well, well, question a little bit. I, I, can't, I can't believe Brisk is in there saying, who the fuck drinks Amaretto with nothing else? I mean, he's got a very good point. I, I drink it all the time on the rocks. Yeah, yes. I, I was going to say, weird. people who make Amaretto? <laughs> all the time. You can, you can drink anything you want on the rocks. I mean, it, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You can you can drink on the rocks on the rocks. Oh, Brisk has started drunk, Br- Brisk has started drinking whiskey properly, although he can, still can't spell whiskey properly. <laughs> well, that's not technically actually. True you either. have to be a specific whiskey to allow be allowed to use the e. Yeah, it's Irish whiskeys. The uh... like Scotch has no e, and hold on, hold we all know I, that I, Scotch I'm, is what, the true whiskey. What is this, the... Eric? Is number two. I had no idea this was a thing. What is a thing? I'm, I'm interested. But... Well, that no, is a it's, strange sentence. It, it, it's bourbon brisk. Just remember, all bourbons are whiskey, but not all whiskeys are bourbons. It, 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 it's just bourbon. Scotch and all with gins no ice. are basically. And, and all gins are basically flavored. Ah, the amaretto. You know, a uh, good friend of mine, Demorg, the actual guy who introduced me to Eve Online, uh, he is a big fan of the amaretto sour. Never had one. I can't say did, I have. Did, did that no. just, like, kill the room? Amaretto sour? I mean... I, I think it's just one of those things of, like, I don't think anybody's had an amaretto sour here, so... The Morg has. I don't... I don't think I've had a decent whiskey sour. I no. drinks, and I, I'm just if, if as a, I like your neighbor with bitter lemon as uh, as a drink. Uh, if we do, if I drink something more heavy than beer or wine, so that's pretty. It's not sweet, but it's it tastes very very nice. I I like Tom Collins's and whiskey sours. However, the problem is. The sour mix, just to get all phlegmy. I think sour mix? I think Risk mm-hmm. is making a dig at all of you right now. <laughs> <laughs> I like Risk's comment down here. Uh, Alvaro Sour is how he drank Alvaro before his balls dropped. I love it. Also, maybe it was the drink that made your balls drop. Yeah, it could have been that. It could have been dun, dun, dun. Is that where all that hair came from? What? <laughs> Honestly. I'm really not sure where to go after that. I, I, I just want to, like... In a, a certain way, and hair started popping up in weird places. <laughs> can, can, we, can we step show. out of, of the, the drink question for a second? Sure, let's move. Did, let's did, move. Did, did we do a show last week? Like, I, I no, wasn't here, but no, I don't know no, if you did no. one. No, you didn't no. show up, so I said... <laughs> Screw it. Do one. Well, no. 
whoa, it's not my yes, my presence for your... a show is not necessary. Come on, Apple, I'm not that necessary. Jesus, it, it's your uh, fault. <laughs> well, your okay, fault. you can blame it on me. I, I am blamed for everything. This is fine. I totally do. Um, I blame yeah, you no, for it, drifters. It, 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 since we didn't do a show last week, uh, can we just congratulate Bruce Grubal, our only oh, yeah. endorsed oh, CSM right. candidate for uh, can his not, election? Can we, can we not talk about CSM, please? No, Thank that, you. That, that was it, Apple. I just wanted to congratulate Brisk as uh, as the endorsed candidate of the show for, for getting on. Good job. And Clearly the push-to-talk bump is real. Yeah. Absolutely necessary. We are... We, I'm just saying, in endorsements, we are 100% over the last two years. Or last two CSMs. That's all I'm saying. Who was last year's? Brisk. <laughs> Brisk didn't run last year. I know. Yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Fucking Eric. Jesus. I mean, if you're saying you didn't endorse him, therefore he didn't win, fine. Wow. That's <laughs> just Just going to say, oh. just going to say, like, if you haven't seen it yet, you should see Brisk's, like, uh, momentous winning you know, sort of uh, video of him I didn't see like, it yet. literally being... We should link. Oh, oh, it's a video of him literally, like, literally uh, at the moment where he won. And it's amazing because he's like, yes, I won! Eric clicking uh, on things, bopping around. Yeah, my cloud. No one heard any of what you just said. Yeah, so it's reset. All oh, right, okay. So, so uh, if you haven't seen it, like you should watch uh, Bristol Ball's like victory uh, video. It may sound it, it may sound like it's going to be super cringy, but it's not. It's basically like him live reacting to winning, uh, and also a hilarious moment when like he something dawns on him, and you should, you guys should watch it because it's absolutely hilarious. So, give me two yeah. seconds, and I'll grab a link. Grab a link, link it. Ah, uh, Briss is trying to find it. Totally real action video. My wife timed it. Nice. There you go. Yeah. Oh, it's like a like? minute long. It's, it's it's worth a watch Ooh. if you haven't seen it. Some might say it's even worth all, worth putting up on the uh, stream. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't really want to aggravate Apple Pear anymore. Br Brisk um. has an OnlyFans page. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting. <laughs> like brisk why are you holding out on us buddy god gotta, gotta get that only fans link to like jesus what do you think he's doing oh my show? god i just watched that freaking video that poor dog <laughs> <laughs> he's just like yeah i got it the dog just flies <laughs> only fans hey, if we're not demonetized it's a family show guys what, um, do you, what do you think? What do you think pays the bills for uh, for the meta show? <laughs> so, so, so only fan, only fans, sort of uh, premium uh, content uh, before you know while he's in the show. <laughs> <laughs> hey, by the way, guys, we're we're down to our last twelve minutes. Can you believe that? Yes. Sorry, I'm watching this video. <laughs> like I absolutely so can't good. believe that we've spent. Well, I've only been here 40 minutes, but yes, I can believe that we've spent that much time chatting utter shit, Eric. That's what we do every week. Oh, uh, I think I came in and made it worse, but at least we're talking about alcohol. We did. Well, you know, we got to have to have a little alcohol. I mean, we, the... we talked some Eve, like I linked a nice kill mill. You did. You did. Early right. in the show, no less. Yeah, yeah, before halfway, which is just like... Yeah. Weird. Of, because I months. because I needed to explain why I was a bit busy. Um, well, no, even before way. that, even before that, because Dirk was talking about the fact that he's actually like you know subscribed in so and doing this things. Titan and and, and yeah. refit it. I know. I got noticed. Like, I, I, I can even sub. undock my Titan, which is you know one of those things. It's a thing, but I wouldn't. Apple might kill you. <laughs> Apple would love to kill my Titan. So, oh, yeah. in the pre-show, we were talking, and I think Bargos was t saying it. Um, you know, he really thinks that the uh, the meta show today is going to be a uh, interesting meta show. 
I mean, we is don't there going really... to be a meta show today? I don't know. Two hours. I, I, I mean, that's that's what I asked. Right. Brisks I, in I the asked, shower. So going? there's got to be a meta show. Like Brisks get oh, ready for fair. it. That's fair. That's fair. That's right. That's right. It's two shower Brisk. Maybe he could uh, give us a, a little bit of a, a preview. Preview from the shower, Brisk. No, um, we don't need another preview shower picture, of Steph. No, that that, that stuff's right, one's enough. One's enough. Why? Why does Brisk love me? I, I don't get this. Everybody loves you. Like, why shouldn't he love you? It's because you're the only person on the show that isn't a dick most of the time. Well, that's not true. Uh, actually, uh, Apple Pear's here today. Apple Pear's well, here, to, and Apple Pear is lovely. Fair, Joe, from that mm -hmm. comment last, me and Brisk spoke. We did kind of have a falling out about me not voting for him. You didn't. Bard no. Goes. What? Yeah. Bard that said. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That said. We are not. We are this not is talking the about I TSM. Admit. We're not talking about CSM. No, no, no we're not talking about the CSM. We're talking about, also not about being so bad. No, no, no. There's a better story no. to this, and I think I I want to believe you'll forgive me. No, no. My SP farm. Yeah. Oh my god. No, no. He left. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. <laughs> serious, serious note, me using my SP farm, I had enough folks that it tipped... Uh... Oh, God, I don't even remember. Who was the last person on uh, that beat Seca. out Laura Seca? No, no, Laura uh, Seca lost. The last person that on that beat out Laura Seca was... Um... It was Phantomite, right? I was... Yeah, yeah, Phantomite. Was Phantomite the last one? Yeah, Phantomite yeah. was the last guy. Was it or was it Torvald? I thought... Oh, no, it might have been Torvald. Hmm. Jesus, where's no, dopamine's Twitter? By the way, by the way, Briss just said in chat that um, that Asher will be on the meta show, so it's going to be a real good one. So in oh, two hours, great. folks, two hours, okay. eight minutes, it'll be a very good, very good uh, meta show. All right, I'm going to bounce so I can get ready for meetings and stuff. You go bounce, you go have meetings, you have fun. You know, I thought Apple Yeah, I'll do two too. of those, but not the third. Okay, so... Uh... Okay, looking at the votes, um, the last the last one on was Torvald at twenty five fifty eight votes by the end of it, and he beat out Laura Seco by uh, two hundred and fifty odd votes. Uh, wait, what are you reading? I'm I'm looking at uh dopamine's uh. Breakdown? Yeah, because the presentation showed Phantomite being the last one on. Uh, yeah, Phantomite was the second last. Okay. Well, Phantomite, Mike, and Brisk all had the same amount of votes because they made it earlier on in the rounds. So, like, they, they mm -hmm. had enough votes from earlier rounds. Torval. So, basically, the last spot was the one that was up for grabs, and Torvald beat out Loris Echo by a couple of hundred votes hmm. okay i'm gonna have to recheck this because that means all of my fun story is ruined well i'm sorry to ruin your fun story and God you know it. i i just want to say you deserve it because you didn't vote for our, 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 our guy like yeah we, on, we officially endorsed him and you like you know i endorsed him i just didn't vote for him however i was gonna say if it was Phantomite that was last on, as I thought the presentation showed, it was my SP farm votes that tipped Phantomite on and pushed Laura Seco well, off, denying the wormhole candidate. Well, CCP yeah. Aurora's uh, like video literally shows uh, Phantomite at 2.456 and mm -hmm. Torvald I mean, at 2.558, so maybe. That's, that's what I'm looking at here. And no, if, I've if, seen if, that one. That if, you go all, if you go all the way to the very end, you've got uh, Gobbins and Merck getting on the first, getting on clear. Then you've got Villy, then Maris, then, uh, no, Villy, then Maria. Then you've got Noms and Kenneth on the same number of votes. Then you've got Brisk, Mike, and Phantomite on the same number of votes. Then you've got Torvald. So... Hmm. I don't know if that's an issue with the way the data is being presented. 
I or... don't know. If that happened, yeah. So I, I'm seeing Torvald as the last guy based on that data. And I, I will admit, I haven't dug into the all of the actual like CSV or whatever of the the actual voting rounds. But yeah. Well, at the end of uh, at the end of Icarus, basically being being dropped out, at least on the uh, uh, CCP Aurora's visualization of it, um, Torvald is higher than Vandermine before Laura before interesting uh, before Laura Seca gets you know. Oh, removed. I know what it is. What you're seeing then, Dirk, is when the after slide where they updated a slide and the more votes would have went on and phantomite would have then got more than torvald did from trans okay so but round 29 round 28 yeah. has torvald behind phantomite round 29 has kenneth above brisk but it still has Torvald, Phantomite, Mike. And then Laura Sacco. Frisk says it's all quota numbers. I don't know what he means by that. I assume he's calling uh, the floor. No, no. He Basically, uh, in every round of votes with uh, STV, there is a quota of votes that you need to reach in order to be elected outright. If you don't reach that quota, then you move on to the next round and the next round, uh, depending on how many people cast first, second, third, fourth, fifth, or only cast first, second, third, as well as, you know, other factors like how the, the pass down of votes works once people further up the ballot have already reached their quota. And it's, it, it's a, it's not exactly simple, but yeah, that uh, I, I kind of understand what Brisk is saying there with uh, with this presentation all being quota numbers. Basically, in every round, there is a quota of votes that you need to reach. And so, say, once you get to round 29, and you see that uh, Innomina and Kenneth have both made it on with 2990, and then you go to round 30, and Innominate and Kenneth both still have 2990 because that was the quota in the round that they made it to. Yeah, it's before they made yeah, it they outright. Get to, they, get, yeah. they get to that, and then the trickle goes somewhere, goes, somewhere you know, else. Yeah. The, the trickle of additional stuff goes to whatever. So, for example, Kenneth's trickle went to Mike Azariah, and then the majority of it went off somewhere else. Uh, actually, just fell, fell off the map. Innominate so maybe. Went to Briz. So maybe but I didn't tell your story at all. So essentially, depending essentially, on and Phantomite, yeah. yeah, essentially Torvald and Phantomite, like literally, when it went went through on the same, like literally, yeah, like photo finish. They they did go through on the last round. That's very true. Yeah. So, uh, so I think Bruce, I, th I think you feel that I made you the wormhole CSM again. <laughs> I, I think he will take it graciously, considering Laura Seco is not. I mean, uh, on, just watching the video of him winning a minute ago, and it's, it's celebrating, and then it's, oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> there is a wormhole CSM. Oh, I, no. I, I, I think, and it's been a while since I've watched this video, but I think I can quote this verbatim. Oh, God, I'm the wormhole CSM again. I think that was <laughs> yeah. it. Alrighty, guys. It's two o'clock. Let's do our one last thing. Burgos, you want to go first? I don't know what to say, to be honest. I, 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 I guess I truly hope there is a war kicking off. And I look forward to the meta show tonight with all the smug that's going to happen. If I'm going to watch that video again. i got to watch that video again. Dirk. All right, so, uh, yeah, first up, again, congratulations, Brisk. Glad to see that you managed to make it back. I hope that you managed to make it a full turn this time. And uh, other than that, 
yeah, Eve looks to be hotting up in a... Just from a, like, looking at the political stuff, things seem to be happening, balls seem to be rolling, and uh, I'm glad to be logging back in and doing stuff uh, again. Um, kind of hoping that I'll, I'll be able to get back into FCing a bit more, but we'll see how my real life goes. But either way, back into Eve and doing stuff, you know, what could be better? There you go. McLeod. Uh, I just wanted to say that, um, uh, yeah, Brisk, awesome job getting back onto the CSM. Um, the only thing that uh, might be a bit of like a oh god kind of moment, uh, aside from the uh, aside from the fact that you realise that you're the CSM, like wormhole CSM, um, <laughs> is that uh, Shines has a Moloch again, I believe. <laughs> I, I thought he oh, finally God. sold oh, no. that. What? I thought he sold it. No, no, Jack. He can't sell it this time because we know how this story he's not goes. Allowed, he's not That's allowed. right. That's right. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm sure he sold it like two months ago at this point. He's probably bought another. Jesus. I know. I know he put one into build, and I'm not entirely certain. Well, I'm fairly certain that's come out of build already. But like, oh, uh, my God. He, Okay, so so Shines had a Moloch, sold a Moloch, built a Moloch. Fucking yeah, hell. Sh Shines had a Moloch, sold a Moloch. Uh, that Moloch was used to basically ban him and uh, and Pando and uh, Brisk. No, 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 no. <laughs> I, I I mean this is a recent thing. I'm pretty sure Shines sold his Moloch like no, end of maybe. April sometime. So if Shines sold a Moloch, then built another one. Like Shines is just kind of crazy, but. Shines, Shines is great is too. Crazy. So he's an awesome level of crazy. It's great. Anyway, that's my that's that was my my one last. Alrighty, folks, and that's another show in the bucket again. So there we go. We're out of here. We'll see you all again next week. Thanks, guys, for showing up. Thanks for the chat. It's always great having everybody here. See you guys. Catch you all later. Don't forget, meta show in two hours. Thank mm -hmm. you.